Hi students, this is our fourth online class, the chapter Plants Increasing the Numbers. In the previous class, we are discussed about new plants from different parts of the plants. That means stem, underground stem, root, leaves, etc. And one more topic we are discussed, crops and vegetables. Okay. Today we are going to study about agriculture. What is agriculture? Plants need to be grown on large scale to feed and their population of country. We know a country has large population. So we have to grow more number of plants on large scale to feed. That is agriculture. Okay. Now, how do farmers grow good and healthy crops? Farmers are healthy crops. First, farmers know about the soil, climate and season for growing the crops. First, farmers know the soil, climate and season. This season is not a seed. Farmers know about the soil, climate and season for growing that seed. They plow and prepare the soil. Second, they plow and prepare the soil. In the end of the soil prepare and soil plow. Plow means and prepare the soil. Third point, they choose healthy and ripe seeds for sowing. They choose healthy and ripe seeds for sowing. Nala healthy idol and nala ripened seed. Sawing in a wind it is selecting with the nulla healthy itla with the selecting. They add manure or fertilizers to the soil. Fourth point, they add manure or fertilizers to the soil. Soil like it, manure fertilizer add yana, manure, balam. Then chemical fertilizer, which are the examples for chemical fertilizer, urea, superphosphate, ammonium, sulfate. Nitrate. These are the fertilizers. Once again, fertilizers like urea, superphosphate, ammonium sulfate, nitrate added to the soil. These are chemical fertilizers. Fourth point, farmers add manure or fertilizers to the soil. So, chemical fertilizers that uh, too much of adding chemical fertilizers that negatively affect the growth of plants. So, Avoid too much of fertilizers, chemical fertilizers to the soil. Food the light chemical fertilizers, soil add a rectangle, other plant in a growth in a negative art and effect. Yeah. So do not use overuse chemical fertilizers to the soil. Fifth point, they irrigate the soil. Irrigate means watering. They irrigate the soil. Soil Okay. Once again, farmers know about the soil, climate and season for growing the seed. They plow and prepare the soil. They choose healthy and dry seeds for sowing. They add manure or fertilizers to the soil. Fertilizers like urea, superphosphate, ammonium sulfate, nitrate. Okay. They irrigate the soil. Next, protection of crops and how they store the seeds. How protect crops and how store the seeds? Engineana crops in a protect in the engineana grains in a store in the first farmers protect the crop against farmers crop in a protect in and in the like grazing animals like cows and goats. Mania Nadakana and the Indian Nadakana grazing fully maya Nadakana cows and goats. Goats in the goat in the cow in the neck. Protect and this is done by proper fencing. Where do you crop? You can see the crop in the cow, goat, grazing animals. Farmers protect the crop against grazing animals like cows and goats. This is done by proper fencing. Second point, farmers use pesticides to protect from locust, grasshopper and caterpillar. What is pesticide? Pesticide. Pesticide means Kedanashini. Farmers use pesticide to protect from locust. What is locust? Locust. Vettigli in the Grasshopper, Pulchadi. And caterpillar. Caterpillar, Puru. Then third point, farmers protect the crop against diseases. Plant in a 
diseases on the veranda protect area. Okay. Next, what are pesticides? This picture shows that applying or spraying pesticides to the field. Field like a pesticide apply in the picture another. What are pesticides? Pesticides are chemicals which are sprayed on crops to protect them from pest and insect. Pesticides are chemicals. Pesticides and the the chemicals are which are sprayed on crops. Crops in the molecule spray the to protect them from pest and insect. Pranigalum insect protect the protect spray in the chemical on pesticides. Okay. How farmers store the grains? How farmers store the grains? Farmers grains and store in the when the grains are ripe, grains, danium, seed, grain, grains are grains are ripe. Nala paritu anagarinal. The crops are harvested and stored. Crops and them harvesting. Harvesting means other parachaduka. And that grains need to be protected against moisture. After that, the grains need to be protected against moisture. Anishesham are grains. Moisture. They have to be keep kept safe from rats, moles, birds, squirrels, and insects. They have to be kept safe from rats. Anishesham rats, alio, moles, m o l e s moles, pericherry. Birds, squirrels, and insects. Idonum Kadakata Salata Sushichivakim. They must be stored in airtight sealed containers. After that, stored in airtight and sealed containers. Abnishesham air gadakata container le store in the vacuum. Okay. Now we are finished our chapter. In this chapter, we have studied about germinations, conditions needed for germinations. Then dispersal of seeds, what are the agents of dispersal, uh, new plants from other parts of plants, crops and vegetables, how do farmers grow good and healthy crops and protection of crops and storage of seeds. These are the things we are discussed. So you have to underline the important points in your textbook and study. Okay, now we have to do exercise questions. Do it in your textbook. Take the correct answers. A seed with two seed leaves is called a. A seed with a seed with two seed leaves is called a tash. A seed with two seed leaves is called dicot seed. A seed with two seed leaves is called dicot seed. Or a seed, two seed leaves, are called dicot seed. Second question: Right soil, warm. Enough air and water are necessary conditions for the growth of seeds. Right soil, warm, enough air and water are the necessary conditions for the growth of seeds. Third question, new plants can grow from the leaves of dash. New plants can grow from the leaves of bryophyllum. New plants can grow from the leaves of bryophyllum. Fourth question. Which feature helps a coconut fruit to float in water? Which feature helps a coconut fruit to float in water? A coconut fruit in a Nadakan Vendita. In the feature help in the answer fibrous outer covering. Answer is fibrous outer covering that helps coconut fruit to float in water. Fifth question. Plants that need clay soil to grow well are plants that need which plant is grown well in clay soil? Answer rice and jute. Rice and jute grown in clay soil. Clay soil level another rice and jute. Sixth question. Pesticides protect crop from being destroyed by dash. Pest. Pesticide protect crops from pest. Pesticides. Protect crops from pest. Pest is in the samrikshikya So answer pest. Okay. 
Next, filling the blanks question. Mays has, first question, Mays has dash seed leaves. Mays. Mays has one seed leaves. Mays has one seed leaves. Second question. Any part of potato that has Any part of potato that has dash on it, on it can grow into a new plant. Any part of potato that has dash on it can grow into a new plant. Potato in the mold and that we are discussed. Potato has eyes or buds. So second answer is eyes or buds. Potato has eyes or buds on it can grow into a new plant. Third question. In India, crops like wheat and gram are grown from November to April. November to April, wheat and gram are under another. And they are called dash crops. That types of crops have one name. What is that? Rabi crops. So third answer is rabi crops. Crops that grown from November to April are called rabi crops. And fourth one, onion and dash need well-drained sandy soil. Onion and groundnut. Fourth answer, groundnut. Onion and groundnut need well-drained sandy soil. Okay. Do it in your textbook and read out your textbook two or three times and underline important sentences. Okay. Thank you. I'm stopping here.